wanted to document the Starbucks stop. Hello, welcome back to my channel. This is the episode two of our California road trip. On this day, we headed from Joshua Tree up to Three Rivers. Oh, and we stopped in a little place called the Pioneer back. Town on the way. In Pioneer Town. It's basically an old western movie set town that was built just to make western cowboy movies. And it was pretty cute. It wasn't anything special, but if you are going that direction anyway, it is a cute stop. Then we basically drove all day. It was a pretty long drive. I think it was four and a half hours or something. I'm not entirely sure, but we stopped along the way and we listened to a lot of music. And there's really nowhere interesting to stop on this drive, unfortunately. So the only stops that we made were coffee stops and like stretching our legs stops. Hello, 11.20 today. Awesome. Okay. Thank you. That's fine. Thank you. And the grande ice. And would you like the straw? No thanks. Thank you. Thank you. When you use this or this. I tried mm -hmm. out a new Starbucks order. I think I got the question. Um, vanilla wow. bean latte at this place, and I actually really liked it. It wasn't super sweet. It looks very sci-fi. The California countryside is actually really beautiful, even in the boring sections, but as we got up towards Three Rivers, it got even more interesting. And we passed Lake Kawia, and then we made our way up through the mountainside into Three Rivers. made it to our next stop. We're here for one night and then we're heading to Sequoia. Okay, so this is problematically nice. This is our Airbnb for only one night, which sucks because what the heck, it's beautiful. And this is our view of the mountains and then Oh my god, it's huge! Okay, and then you go out here, and you have a really nice patio, and then this is our backyard view with all these trees. I love! Okay, I'll go take a shower, and then we can drink our wine. And are and you do hungry our... yet? Not quite, but I don't mind starting and I'll drink. <laughs> Where's the bag of stuff for the freezer? Um, it's in our bedroom. It's all in our bedroom. I can come. <laughs> I want to live in this house. It's so nice. <laughs> Kill me. Like, literally, I don't know if you can tell, but this is the view. And it's just so nice. I want to live here. There's like a literal fire pit here. How do I show you? And you can just chill and make fire and barbecue your s'mores. There's also a barbecue. And... And I never want to leave. The Airbnb at this place was really nice, so I really enjoyed our very brief stay there and I wish we could go back and stay for longer. I think Three Rivers is about the perfect jumping off spot to head to Sequoia National Park and also to head to Joshua Tree down south if you're headed coming from the north. So now I can did you look at the books at all? What? Did you look at the books at all? Yeah. I'd be terrible. Oh, what is this? Discover California. Yeah, I shall discover it. I'm in the process. Alcatraz. I never did I I don't think I had it out there. Hmm. But pretty interesting.
there's not really anything to do in particular in this town except for enjoy the nature and like hike a bit so maybe two nights would be okay but i think one night was honestly about right i just like this hotel a lot good morning it's 7 30 and i just woke up and this is our view i don't know if you can tell But it's really nice out there. There were some wild quail in the yard, so I tried to go find those, but they ran away from me, so I couldn't get any pics. But this was their beautiful house. next morning we got up and we packed up the van or the car again but they don't look like crows do they i feel like they're bigger and we drove uh, the i think it's about oh no it was about two and a half hours i believe to Sequoia National Park. So it wasn't a long drive, or maybe it was even just one and a half hours. Like it really wasn't that far the next day. And McCarthy, Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer, and the White House do agree that some type of short the drive term spending up into the park is pretty windy. And they make you pay an entrance fee, but since we had the America the Beautiful Pass which is valid for all national parks in the US. We just showed them that on the way in and then we were good to go. I really recommend purchasing that trip if you're going on a US road trip where you're visiting more than one national park because this pass costs about $80 for a year and it lets you see all national parks and once you've like each national park seems to be about a 30 or $35 entry so once you've seen two or three it's worth buying the pass. Welcome back to the vlog. Sequoia National Park. In Sequoia, people say that it's a bit of a trick to avoid the crowds, so I recommend going not on the weekend, not in the summer season, and trying to like go early and avoid the crowds by taking trails that are less popular. We did the Crescent Lake or Crescent Meadow Trail, which was really, really good. <laughs> I do really highly recommend it. You can get there on the free shuttle in the summer months or just drive okay. there anytime. Off we go on our hike without these people. So what? Am I getting Is that an email? Hmm. Weird. I'm gonna go see the big tree. We're doing the two hour crescent meadow loop trail and it's basically a very easy loop around a meadow in the woods and you see beautiful sequoia oh. trees and we saw a black bear in real life it was so cool we actually saw a real black bear like not that far from us i was mm. like i did really didn't expect to actually see a bear so i think that, yeah this is definitely the first time i've ever seen a bear in the wild so that was very very cool okay Thank you! Actually, a 
black bear. I can't zoom in good enough for this. Okay, this is so cool. What the heck? Hello, little bear. I know. The root is really interesting. Yeah. That's beautiful. That's kind of pretty. Oh, after that hike, we drove up to Tokopa Falls Trail, which is a trail at the northern end of the park. That's supposed to be really beautiful because it Falls ends in a waterfall and it's also a bit less crowded. However, by the time we started walking on that trail, we realized that we were actually too tired and we decided to head back and get food instead. But from what I could see on the beginning of the trail, this would probably be a really nice hike as well. And the scenery looked pretty different to the other hikes down in the central part of the park to another hike thingy, but we decided to skip it and go get some food instead. But I thought I'd show you the scenery. It's so cute! So this might be quite cool if you have some extra time to spend. of peanut butter cups and the best kombucha ever. That evening we drove out into the countryside and we had tacos at a lodge restaurant that was out in the middle of nowhere. We were there on our all on our own but we went because it was really highly reviewed and the tacos were actually really good so... Yeah! <laughs>